At the test site, we perform a lot of generalized experiments that we use to simulate conditions inside of spray dryers, dust collectors, cyclonic separators, other typical process equipment to try to figure out two things. One, how the explosions actually develop, and two, how to best intercept or suppress them. And then we then take FIKE products, apply it to those same hazards, and make sure that they will work in a customer-specific application. Our test facility is really advanced. We're constantly upgrading our software and data packages to make sure that our data is the most accurate that we can possibly make it. Also, through standardization of systems and making it very easy for our technicians to set things up, it really reduces our setup time and increases our turnaround time on most tests, which means that in a lot of regards, we're able to do tests faster and cheaper than a lot of other people. I think that what we do is really important because we are that last line of defense. Until something gets tested against an explosion in the intended application, it's a theory. It's a nice idea, it's great engineering drawings, it's fantastic manufacturing, but until it sees fire, it's still a theory. 